My name is Brenda Baker and I'm the office manager for Wyoming Agriculture in the Classroom and I've been with the organization for four years. I just can't think of anything more wonderful than, than being able to be a part of contributing to that lesson being taught in that class to that kid that is interested in staying in this state because of that information they wouldn't have had otherwise. And I just feel so incredibly fortunate to be working with such uh, knowledgeable and passionate people. It's just such a great organization. Love everything, love everything about it. It also gives those kids the opportunity to think about, you know, I've always kind of liked being outside. So what's what else is there going on with this ag thing? Or I love science. So what does that mean in the, the minerals and energy part of these lessons? And I think as they get older, hopefully, hopefully, uh, they'll take a look at that and say, wow, I do want to stay in Wyoming. The opportunities are here and they kind of fit in with what I'm interested in. That's truly my hope. We live in a great state. We just. We have so many opportunities, and I think by not giving kids this information, we're doing a terrible disservice. I refer back to ag just because of my background, but you assume that you feed them and take them, you know, take them to be processed, and, and that's not all there is to it. I think that those are the kinds of things that are important for kids to know about and to be able to experience in a classroom, to have just a little snapshot of what that looks like. It's a great opportunity to teach stewardship in a way that they can relate to who hasn't taken a hike through a, a park or, you know, so many people have had the opportunity to go to Devil's Tower and what that means um, stewardship wise. You can impact a kid's life by you know, showing them the importance of one, the stewardship part of it, but just giving them other options as they're growing up. If you're not exposed to it, you don't know that those options are available. And as they get older, hopefully they'll remember what they were taught in second, third, fourth, and fifth grade and remember how much fun it was. Um, you know, they're learning science in a way that they're down on the floor and, and instead of writing it down on a piece of paper. And I, I think that's phenomenal. I just can't think of anything more wonderful than, than being able to be a part of contributing to that lesson being taught in that class to that kid that is interested in staying in this state because of that information they wouldn't have had otherwise.